suspension is over and you get to get back to the team and help them in the race here. Yeah, I feel good. I'm excited to get back. Obviously, the two weeks seems a lot longer uh, than it really was, but uh, excited to get back for sure. When you, uh, I mean, lots has been going on this season for you, but you feel like you kind of put everything back. It's a stretch run here. Kind of get in there and just make the kind of impact you think. Right? Yeah, it's important for me to to have the impact I did at the, in the beginning of the season. I think that two weeks I, I got to, to obviously work really hard, but uh, I got to reset the mind. And um, like you mentioned, the the final stretch here are important games, and uh, I need to be good for us. You're gonna get a lot of guys back as the stretch right happens. I guess if you guys kind of like the spot you're in right now, now you're gonna get some. You're coming back. Other guys are gonna start coming back. And, you know, yeah. Yeah, we, we like where we're at. Obviously, uh, it's tight. You can't have a bad week of hockey. Uh, you could slip right over the playoffs. But uh, the moves Kenny made, obviously, watching from afar and the teams on the road. Uh, as a player, you get very excited. And uh, we all should be very excited. We put ourselves in a, in a position to, to play meaningful hockey in March. And um, we added some pieces, some good pieces. And um, I know the players. I know I'm very excited. I was excited watching from home, and I, I, the, the city should be very excited as well. How much fun is this? Because I know it can get stressful, but this is what you guys play for, right? Oh, this stressful. Yeah, this, you just you want to play meaningful hockey. I think you work hard all summer. You train hard for uh, for March, April, May, June, and uh, that's where we're at right now. The, the games mean everything, and um, this is the best time to, to be a hockey player, especially in a market like this. When you get a suspension like that, Zach, do you kind of reach out to your teammates and say, hey, sorry? Uh, no, no, they know I didn't mean any intent to injure or anything. That was a reactionary play. Obviously, I told George right away, you can't do, you can't kick people, you can't use your skate blade. Obviously, um, I was, uh, that was my, my fault, and uh, I accepted that, obviously, but uh, my teammates knew it was, uh, it was not on purpose. I don't think I owe them an apology. I think the best way I can show them that I care and show them that I want to be here and, and, and help the team win is by playing hard when I come back. What have you done during that time? Have you worked on something specific? Or? I sat on the couch and <laughs> ate burgers. No, I'm just kidding. No, yeah, this, you put in a lot of work. You obviously uh, you want to come back and you don't want to lose a step. And obviously the games are so important right away. So uh, I've been doing a lot of skating, um, a lot of skill work. And um, no excuses when we come back here. It's uh, we play 17 games or 18 or 16 games in March, all important games. And I need to be good. What did you make of the additions just on trade deadline day? Kind of yeah, it was exciting. It was very exciting for me. Obviously, I wasn't playing in any games, so obviously you're you're watching it from TV, watching it from afar. And um, when you always can be a buyer, um, it's it's a fun team to be a part of. I think uh, everybody um, finds new life, uh, finds that extra energy. Obviously, in January, February, you know, in the grind days, but. Uh, now that we're here in March and, and we made some moves to get better and, and for our playoff push and hopefully get in the playoffs and make some noise, um, it's a new breath of fresh air. And um, I know as players, that's that's all you can ask for. It was a condensed schedule, so seven games, just kind of kind of two weeks. How do you feel game shape wise? I guess you know what they were talking. Uh, I feel good. Uh, we we sat down with the coaching staff and then. And we made sure that we could uh, simulate a game and, and, and some games as much as possible, made sure we keep my conditioning up. So that shouldn't be a factor uh, in any shape or form. Zach, just with the new forwards, do you look at the new look lineup and think where you slot in, or do you just automatically assume? No, you're... no, that's the coach's job. I think um, we want to win hockey games, and to win hockey games, you have to be deep. And um, that's what we are. When, when everyone's healthy, we're deep, we're a good team. And I think that's what we need. You look at teams that win the cup, that's what they have. I think our main focus right now is just to get into the playoffs. And uh, if we get in the playoffs, everything, anything can happen. We know that, especially with the guys we have in our room. So, um, like I said, it's an important month coming ahead. Excited to be back fresh and, and ready to go and put my best effort. And if they give you the choice, you want to go back with Connor? Yeah. Oh, you give everyone the choice. They're going to want to go back with Connor, right? It's, uh, I'm going to play wherever the coach thinks uh, I can help the team and be most successful. I think uh, I don't read too much into that. We're, I'm here to win. Um, I know everyone in that room feels the same way. So whatever lines, combinations he finds and works, uh, we're going to stick with him and roll him. And like I said, we want to be a good team. We want to be a deep team. Um, doesn't matter where I play, and I know everyone feels the same way.